Leaders from Serbia and Kosovo are back in Brussels for the ninth round of talks aimed at normalising relations between the two. EU officials have made it clear that Belgrade's chances of opening negotiations to join the 27-member bloc depend on finding a deal with Pristina. One sticking point for the Serbian government is the degree of autonomy that ethnic Serbs living in northern Kosovo would enjoy. They've created parallel institutions financed by Belgrade, such as hospitals, schools and even courts that operate under Serbian law. Kosovo wants these institutions dismantled. One MEP, an expert on Kosovo, said failure would scupper Serbia's EU ambitions. Nobody in the European Union, neither those who are more on the side of the Serbs, would allow a second Cyprus in the European Union, meaning a country which doesn't have clearly defined borders. Serbia refuses to recognize Kosovo's 2008 declaration of independence. Russell says it must do so before it can join the EU. Its independence has already been recognized by more than half of UN members.